Hello, internet. Oh, no, I'm going to move the camera size to make life easier. So, uh, hi, yes. Um, so no cameras for people today because we have a very special guest. Miss Adrian Curry will be joining us in a little bit. Um, Nando's bringing her up right now. I'm actually really looking forward to meeting her because we have a lot in common. It's kind of funny. Um, but it will be a good time. So, sorry, no cameras for anyone tonight. I know this is like the first time in years that we've not about cameras but you can still type chat and she will still be able to see what you're writing so in the meantime got to show you what i got today and now live guest adrian curry just kidding adrian <laughs> time I, to... I just trolled the entire chat room that yeah was so i was that was mean i was thinking of something mean to say and then i realized you're my boss and i probably <laughs> shouldn't call there, Courtney. Uh, but yes i got final sure. fantasy 13 too and it's the collector's edition and i'm so excited to play it except i can't play it until tomorrow because i have other stuff going on tonight so um i I was going to say, I'm like, here. I just hear voices. You had fun watching X play to death. You died. Oh, because you're bleeding to death. Yes. Four disc soundtrack. Our book. Actually, I can show you stuff while we're waiting. They have a smooth cover. Unboxing. Look, it's like a book. And it's soft to the touch. It's gorgeous. Um, game. Art book. Four disc soundtrack. You got that? Yeah. Wait, what is is that? This is Final Fantasy Thirteen Two. Holy crap! Yeah, this is the collector's edition. So it has. Oh, it comes with art. it. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. one giant, beautiful book. Nice. Beautiful book. Very cool. I'm gonna sit back here. I'm not All gonna right. Chair. Yeah. You're welcome. Let me <clears throat> stick this thing in here. Awesome. Yay. Yay. I'm excited, except I don't have time to play it until tomorrow. Oh, dear. So I know what I'm doing this weekend. Okay, so I'll be getting a I'm calling in sick uh, tweet. Or no, a no, no, I'll be fine. No, when I get Mass Effect, there might be oh, okay. one of those. Okay. I said Mass Effect 3. Well, luckily, this one's only two days after straight date, so hopefully it won't be so bad waiting for Mass Effect 3. That's I'll just true. have to stay off the internet for two, three days. And if anybody spoils Mass Effect 3 for me, I will ban you from the room forever. She will ever. Bangs and alien. What? Shepherd bangs an alien. <gasps> oh my! Wait, that happened in that happened Mass Effect One, and that happened in Mass Effect Two. Come on. Well, unless you choose not to. Although, actually, it's funny. I didn't get romances either time I played Renegade. I guess I was too much of a bitch to have anyone fall in love with me. <laughs> so I. <laughs> no, you can't. I was I was femme chef. Um, but yeah, I I would have tried Jack, and then I actually went back and decided at the last minute to try real quick romances with Thane and Garrus, and I made that work. So Darth Vader is Luke's father. Like how the word Vader is what German for father? No, we knew it the whole time. Except we don't speak German. Yeah. That's my internet. Oh, he loves me more than G4 itself. Don't say that. Wow. Love Flattery G4. will get you anywhere. <laughs> just I'm, keep, I'm keeping an eye out. That's fine. That's fine. We're just waiting. Adrian will be here. Yep. Patience. Patience, young it's, Jedi. You know, she stunned all of you into silence on Twitter today. It's like everybody stopped tweeting when she was on. So, mm -hmm. And I was actually looking for oh, tweets yeah, on Twitter attention. afterwards. And you all stopped talking. So that made it they very were, hard. They were the, for, the pheromones must have gone through the TV. The pheromones went through the TV. I want to try this perfume because you guys know that I love perfume. It smells. Oh yeah. I'm there wearing some, right. but that's okay. Oh, it's it's faded, go. so it'll be fun. So I can record. Right? Yeah. I think so. Awesome. All righty. Let us get rolling. It's Mama Clay. Hello. I'm Courtney. Lovely to meet you. I know. Come you have are. a seat. Hey, meet the internet. Yeah. No, I've never, ever, oh, oh it's, I know it's difficult to sit in a corset. Oh, I'm fine. I was wearing one yesterday. Ladies and gentlemen, Adrian Curry! I have the same webcam. Those are badass or HD. Okay. That's what I really love them. So, gamer, cosplayer, geek, corset lover. Are you sure we're not related? Because <laughs> I was wearing a corset yesterday. So I just got I this from a New Orleans Wizard World Comic Con. Nice. About four, yeah. She was like, this is the best advertising ever. Because it was like running around like, and everyone's like, where did you get that? And then Comic Con. Comic Con is gorgeous. 
Are you a dominatrix? Are you, he asks. Only if people Only, ask. Yes. <laughs> Be careful what you wish for, because you just might get it. So, uh, you are a hardcore gamer nerd. So I am. I like to play. Um, I'm dating one of my guild members, mm -hmm. which nice. is kind of fun. And, you know, it's good because we have common interests mm -hmm. and stuff. And I don't get pissed at him if he's like playing and mm -hmm. talking to our friends. Because you understand. Mm -hmm. You know what it's like. Yeah, I, I tried that once. I didn't. Was somewhere. there no time for each other? No, it turns out he had a girlfriend and lied about it. So, not no, all of us are that lucky. I know, just... but that's okay because when his girlfriend found out, she forced him to quit. So it was like sweet revenge, sweet revenge. Forced him to quit. If I found out, I'd be like, get your ass out of my house and yeah. my life. Yeah, I, I'm surprised. There's... So, what are you playing these days? Um, I'm playing a lot of Star Wars The Old Republic. Um, it's beautiful. I, I felt that the cinema in it, all the openings for each character were better than like all three of the new Star Wars oh, movies. Oh my god, yes. They but were just good stories. Yeah. I mean, do you play any of the other games like Mass Effect or uh, Dragon um, Age or anything like that? I play, I play Warcraft. Mm -hmm. I play that. I play, um, damn it, what is it? I'm forgetting what it is. It's a game that you constantly die in. Can I just it's PlayStation. I'll remember in a second. I'm brain Dark farting. Souls? Yes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm like, thank you. I always hear about people are like, oh, I keep dying in this incredibly yeah, hard game. Yeah, I got Souls. Oh, so you're more of an RPG. So. Yeah, I like, I like yes. RPGs. I um, just got Final Fantasy today, and I can't wait to go home and play it. I got Tekken as well. Nice. I got me a Fighters. fight stick. I love fighter ones. Mm -hmm. um, Marvel vs. Capcom. Marvel vs. Capcom. Second Mortal Kombat. Is Bridge. the bomb. It is. And I loved it. I I think two years ago mm -hmm. at San Diego Comic Con, they had a Marvel vs. Capcom party, uh -huh. and I go and all these drunk nerds are playing, and I'm like, oh, let me play. And they're like, oh, she's gonna suck. So I'm thinking, okay, I don't know any of you know the moves, but I do know that all I have to do is a bunch of combos. Yeah. So I'm probably gonna fuck them up. Mm -hmm. I own their asses. I just fucking mop the floor with them, and they're all like, <laughs> yeah, that's the best. Talking shit. Yeah, especially you know people who are like anti-female gamers like oh you can't nearly be as good as us and then you just wipe the floor with them and it feels good regardless if we're as good as you or not you mm -hmm. bet your whole lives that all you want is a chick to play a yes game. and then when you meet chicks who play games you give them shit it's like yeah, you guys it's, are it's really stupid. you know not not helping <laughs> your situation here it's that whole e theme concept you know, they think it makes you better. So I'm, I'm curious about this perfume that you brought on the show. What, well, I gave you a little sum of it, but I gave it to Kevin. Oh, uh, okay. Um, I just want to try it because I love perfume. It's called too, e so. mm -hmm. and it has synthetic human pheromones <laughs> okay. in it. So what it does is it's scientifically proven to cause arousal oh. and social uh, calmness. Mm -hmm. Like, say you're going out and you wear it. Like when you're drunk. Kind or of. for me, pitch meetings for <laughs> shows, you know, sizzle you reels. Yeah, I'll put it all on. Where, where, where can people get some? Um, erocks.com. Erocks.com. Yeah, it's okay. only from the internet. It's a uh, fragrance for the internet on the internet. Awesome. <laughs> I'm, I, I might just have to get some to add it to my many, many. Ask Kevin for before Get he your leaves. rocks on. I, I might if I if I spot them. Um, so if you guys have questions for Adrian, please feel free to ask. Um, I will scroll up and see. Does it smell like the internet? No, it smells Thank goodness. Good. I don't, I don't know. Because I imagine the internet smells like a really overcrowded Comic Con. Yeah. With the guy in the Predator and Alien costume that's all latex, just like butt sweat. Sweating. Yeah. Tripping out. Yeah. So, um, Alliance or Horde? I am both. But my main tune is Alliance. Now, for Star Wars, I am Dark Side all the way. Heck yeah. Yeah. Empire or just Dark Side? Um,. Well, I'm a bounty hunter, mm -hmm. but everything I guess that's technically imperial. Yeah, everything that I choose pretty much says that I'm just getting more and more evil. So I like that. That is fun. Sometimes you just you have to be badass. If you can't be mean to people in real life, at least you can force choke them over the internet. Yeah, well like the first okay. few times I was given options, mm -hmm. it's like, Oh, will you help me? I'm like, Oh, I gotta help him and then I remember this is the internet. Mm -hmm. This is where we all come to be trolling assholes. Yeah. So I started trolling all the tunes and like shooting people in the head and telling their kids like, Oh, you'll think me later i'm like this is awesome that that is awesome i need yeah. to do what server are you on are you um on i'm not on yet because i need a new gaming rig oh, but as soon as i am i will tweet you and i'll let you know because i want to play an imperial agent and i want to play as a sith warrior 
character. I was really lucky. My ex-husband, uh, one of his best friends, Dan Bibley, is the VP of NVIDIA. Oh, okay. So I have a pretty sweet you got the hookup. <laughs> gaming tower. Yeah, it has all these cooling fans, mm -hmm. lets you know the temperature of your tower, and it glows. It's pretty. I need to do that. I have so many people offer to build the, a, a gaming PC, except I don't own a desk. I should just suck it up and do I know. She's Girl, giving me that Ikea. look. Ikea. I know. I know. I will. I'm moving rooms. I will get a desk. I promise. And I'll get a nice gaming rig. All well, right, you guys. Yes, desk. PS3 and Xbox 360. Mm -hmm. I've got those as well. So I'm Like, who PC... do you think you're talking to? Of course. Yeah, I'm a PC yeah. gamer, but I've got everything. I even have a smart TV, mm -hmm. so it feels like the Nintendo Ooh. Wii. Cool. You're just like, Wii, I have a smart TV. It's like, uh, of course I do. I'm rich. <laughs> You got some money. So Gage wants to know what's your prediction for the Super Bowl? Um, my prediction for the Super Bowl is Giants, and mm -hmm. I have to go with Giants because when I used to live in New York, I partied with a couple of them a few times, went to some strip clubs, and because of mm -hmm. that, we bonded and go Giants. Yay! <laughs> yeah. I'm one of those people who's going to be kind of avoiding the Super Bowl. It's not really my thing. I'll, I'll well, if you're avoiding one. avoiding it a few days after the Super Bowl, mm -hmm. if you want to unwind, you can yeah. watch The Tester with me. And I was just about to ask, where can people watch the new season of The Tester? Well, if you, the you don't have PlayStation Network, mm -hmm. you can also watch it on thetester.com. Okay. And I believe they're going to upload a few of the episodes to YouTube as well, so you can see the whole thing awesome. online. Can you give us a little teaser, like what we have to look forward to um, this season? Maybe. There's a really hot chick on this season. <laughs> I could not stop it. I mean, oh. she's gorgeous. She's covered in tats. Yes. Fucking hot chick gamer covered in tats. I, I mean, who doesn't happy. love that? I think we all love that. Yeah. Yeah. I I, I was trying to test the trying waters Trying to not there. have bias, I assume, as a judge. Oh, right? no. I tried really hard not to have bias because <laughs> I'm like, okay, yes, yeah, she's very beautiful, but is she what we need? And then I even thought, would she be a distraction in the mm -hmm. office? Well, that's up to her to be professional, but I have to let you go now, Adrian. Thank you so much for coming thank by. Thank you. It was so Bye, Internet clubs. Bye, Adrian. Well, actually, I'll <laughs> stick around and hang out with you, Internet, but uh, unfortunately, Adrian, have to go bye-bye. Yeah, i got to go shopping. Go shopping I'm and go, go gaming. gaming. Yeah, yeah have a wonderful like time. It's lovely meeting you. You too. Oh, thank you. Right. Did you guys have fun? I hope you guys had a good time. That was fun. Her breasts, her breasts are amazing. I like mine, except mine aren't being held up right now. So, yeah, sorry, no chem slots today. Oh, Tim Curry. I would love to also have Tim Curry on the show. What games does she play? Oh, well, you guys, you just missed it all. Um, she was currently playing Swator and uh, Dark Souls. And her back. Sorry. Oh, you're such a... You need a tissue. Oh, no. Let me fix the camera back to... I can't win. I can't win. Does she have a Star Wars account? Of course she has a Star Wars account. She was saying that she was playing it. But it, you can find her at Adrian Curry on Twitter. And then you can, uh, let me take out the caption. Um, you can find her on Twitter and always ask, say, hey, what server are you on? I want to play. Um, so, uh, if you're new, where can you find me? Well, here, every night at 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. Or you can find me on Twitter at the anime goddess, because I love anime. Um, I was going to say, oh yeah, so as you guys may or may not know, uh, Adrian Curry was the very first winner of America's Next Top Model, which I am crazy about. Um, and I'm actually writing a play that's a parody of Top Model, and I actually wrote a character based on her <laughs> named Masamon Curry. So I, I pay tribute to Adrian. So I just thought it was really funny that she happened to be on in here and meeting her. So. Why do I never appear on AOTS? Because nobody ever asks me. I need to do that when Vinny's in Go, go ask Vinny Rutherford. <laughs> Why not? I don't know. Can't always win. Um, but I have been on, I've been on a couple episodes of Fresh Ink Online. And I do this every night, so you can always see me here. Have I seen the anime Spiral? I have not seen Spiral. I don't know. Kind of bring us, this is a Moldavite, Moldavite ring, which is a really, really old meteorite kind of thing. Can I get my teeth so white? I don't know, I need to brush them. Um, part of it is the camera, uh, and our slightly higher than normal life contrast that happens. So, you probably just look lighter. Although, actually, here's a key. And I'm going to tell it to... Uh, uh, how many of you guys in here have braces, or have had braces in your life? Because I had braces for many years in junior high. 
And unfortunately, um, when you have the metal braces, and if you can, if you can get Invisalign, get Invisalign. I loved it. Um, you know, they 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 use cement to put, to put the the braces on your teeth. Um, but once I got my braces off, I had stains from the cement. Some of the cement remained on my teeth. So for years, I had these yellow patches on my teeth, and I was really self conscious about it. Um, and I started seeing a new dentist, and she said, "Oh, I could just file that off for you." And she literally just took a drill. I went and just very lightly scraped off the cement and my teeth were 10 times whiter because the cement was gone. And actually, uh, one of them here, there was some cement that was like stuck in a corner. So she actually drilled out the tooth a little bit and um, filled it with the bonding. So it's all white again. Um, didn't even hurt. Didn't even hurt. I have a beautiful smile because I invested a lot of money in it. I also got Invisalign and I got my fillings replaced. So you can't even see that I have like eight. <laughs> eight fillings in my mouth. Um, my smell is terrible. No, it's not. You're just jealous. You're jealous. Uh, but yeah, Invisalign, totally worth it. What's my favorite anime? What's my favorite anime on Netflix Instant? I don't know what my favorite one on Netflix Instant is. Um, it would have to be something that I actually enjoy a dub of. So let's say maybe... No, wait, I have that on DVD. I forget. Favorite anime ever? Probably Revolutionary Girl Utena. I really like Helsing too. You still have a retainer, but you haven't used it in years. Yeah. There's, you could probably sterilize it if you really want to. I wear my retainer every night. It's basically just more invisible entries. What's it like working at G4? Is it as, as awesome as we think it is? Well, yes and no. You know, the thing is, it is still a business. You know, it's still a corporation, so it's still a job and still work. Um, that's what, why it. What are you doing? Um, but at the same time, it's very interesting work. You know, most of us here are writing about video games or tech or other geeky stuff that we love. You know, if you work on Attack of the Show and there's something that you're really passionate about, you could always pitch a segment. You know, it could be like, hey, I love cool t-shirts. Now they have threads or cool sneakers. Now they have sneaker heads. And, you know, they have, they have fresh ink. And I don't know if there's much interest in doing an anime segment, but they do show anime on um, uh, uh, cinema Asian underground. So sometimes you see it on there. Um, we should pitch a cosplay segment. No, I'm not the best person to do cosplay, but I do know some people who would be excellent to do cosplay. What happened to Adam Sessler's hair? He decided to shave it off and grow more down here. And quite frankly, I like it. I promote that if, you know, if a guy is losing his hair, just shave it off. It makes you look younger. And he does look younger and hipper with it. So good on you, Sessler. Good on you. Uh... Death Note, Death Note is good, except I stopped after episode, well, no, I watched more past episode 26, but once, um, once it changed villains-ish, it got less interesting to me. I didn't think the new, uh, I didn't think the new villain was at all, um, interesting. Yeah. I just, he, you know, I'm talking about Nier, he's just kind of, I'm like, Nier, just because you do this. Does not make you scared. Oh, I heard a lightsaber. <laughs> I can always tell the sound of a lightsaber. Yeah. Haha, <laughs> you're that's almost not at all complimentary. Hey, Courtney, Nando yes. has something to say. Nando? What's hey, up? Hey, what's everyone, up? Nando. Hey, everybody. My favorite guy from talent who very kindly brings us all together. So everybody say thank you. I sat in that Nando. chair before I did. Is that a rule? You wanted to sit in the I chair that you did. But, and oh my I, god, and she's I, taking it crazy. And I hugged her and I hugged her before she left. Oh, you I feel like I should have. I just learned that like Yeah. I just it learned that's best best let them initiate, let, always let the guests initiate because yeah. some of them mm -hmm. are weird and some of them like to hug oh. and you know, I just let them do their thing. Yeah. Hopefully so, you guys saw um Adrian hug Sarah on the show and we tweeted it out. So I think uh, Candace tweeted it out. So nice. take a look for that. That's going to be then, hot. I mean, I don't blame Adrian being interested in Sarah. Sarah's gorgeous and super nice and an awesome totally, girl. Totally. So we'll see what happens mm -hmm. with that. Uh, I just figured I'd come on today and let you know who's on for next week. Because I think we announced a couple of them on the tease. Mm -hmm. But just so you know, uh, on Monday's show, we're mm -hmm. going to have uh, Key and Peel from Comedy Central. They just have a new cool. sketch show out. They're really funny guys. Uh, Tuesday, we have Steve Yun. Mm -hmm. from The Walking Dead. Oh, cool. Glenn from The Walking Dead. So I'm really mm -hmm. psyched for that. So the new season starts next mm -hmm. Sunday. And uh, and then Wednesday, we're going to have Ray Park. Because, you know, I Star Wars. Because Star Wars is coming. Oh, my God. I can't. 
<laughs> he's like he's like my martial arts idol. Uh, I love Bray Park. Yeah. So okay, and, like uh, you can you can hip toss me any day, right off. Yeah, and Ray then Park. not goot yet, not goot yet. We'll not see goot when yet. Goot, okay. Not goot. Wow, look at the demand for goot. Oh, we're, wow. we're working on okay. it. They're working on it. And then uh, Thursday, uh, we have Stephen Van Zandt, who's okay. got a new uh, show on Netflix coming out called uh, Lily Hammer. We did the trailer a couple weeks back on uh, on uh, on the show. So, That's hilarious. That's cool. Yeah. And then and then Adrian just want me to remind everybody that she's on the Tester, which yes. uh, is going to be on the PlayStation Network as of February seventh, mm -hmm. Tuesday. So uh, yep. looking and forward to that. And thetester.com, I believe she said. And thetester.com as well. Yes. So you can do, tune in for that. And, uh, yeah. And, hey, guys, I'm on Twitter, too. Nando Vell, yes. if you want, Go feel free. And, uh, and that's it. And I'll keep trying to do these updates when I can. We and I will let people know when Gutenberg's coming. Yes. And, uh, oh, and a tease. I booked somebody this week. I, I can't say who. I, um, I feel like I hate saying the tease. But I booked somebody that uh, I think some people are going to be really happy about. Somebody who's a long time coming. Oh, somebody okay. who's been wanting for the longest time. George I'll give, Takei? I'll give one hint. Uh, he's on, you know, maybe. Uh, I'll Are give one hint. Uh, if you if you have a bingo card, you'll be able to fill it. That's all I'm going to say. Okay. So, uh, I, I don't get the that long time clue, long so. time fans George of the show. Long time fans are gonna know are gonna know what the bingo card is from. Okay. So, uh, long time we'll AOTS see. fans, man. I'm, yeah. I should figure this out. No, we've had Matt on before. Yeah, he's in England. I would love. Yeah, he's in England right now. Trust me, we will we will hopefully yeah. get him back. I think he, hopefully he'll come back for Comic Con. Yeah. Yeah. You so. know what would have been funny what? if Adrian had come yesterday because I had a course set with me too. Um, we just could have had like you could have been sisters. I would have been like, will you I mean, lace me up? We like, could have been sisters. Wait, will, will you bind me up? So yeah. She is like my sister. I'm like she likes corsets and video games. And she's hot. And she's and hot. You're, hot. you're both and hot. She's a nerd. And so, she's a nerd. Yeah. So there you go. Uh, so we will, uh, and I will see what I can do about bringing guests up. It's always depending it's on if they have time, because this is Hollywood, yeah. and they have to run around sometimes, and sometimes yeah. we can only get them for a little bit. Yeah, but especially I when keep... people are promoting things. Yeah, I promise I'll keep trying. Awesome. I okay. appreciate it. We've had three guests this week. I know. That's like a first. Three guests. It's insane. Yeah. We'll see what we can keep coming. Okay. Awesome. You Thank you, Nando. Bye-bye. Wait, your glasses. Just... Oh, my glasses. Ray Park. <laughs> Ray Park. <laughs> I'm going to get into a car accident because I can't <laughs> Come on, people. Ray Park. Darth fucking Maul. <sighs> Gotta make this happen, Nando. I will keep... I, I was bugging Nando to bring in Adrian since last week, so I'm like, I'll keep bugging you to bring in Ray Park, because that'd be awesome. Cool. And, and Snake Eyes. And Toad from X-Men. What does this I have on my wrist? It is a symbol. As you guys know, I am writing a manga which launches online on or about February 24th. Um, this is a symbol that recurs in the manga and it's in the logo. I'm going to do my other wrist with another thing from the manga. Um, but for more on that, you can follow me on Twitter at the Anime Goddess or my manga's Twitter at World of Sora and uh, you'll find more. Darth Maul died a ridiculous death. He got cut in half. Well, that's what happens when somebody swings a lightsaber with you at you and makes contact. You get you get effed up. You get real effed up. So, am I looking forward to Mass Effect Three? Is the sky blue? Do we breathe oxygen? Yes, I'm looking forward to Mass Effect Three. Clearly, you you haven't been watching the show much. I am so ready for Mass Effect Three, but I'm gonna be getting the game a couple days later than everyone else. So. That suck. At least date for World of Sora. I'm aiming for February 24th. Um, oh, no. It's not official. But we'll see. Will I romance Jessica's character? Um, no, because I love Garrus. Garrus is my one true love, and I'm very much looking for. And and I romanced Caden, the Kaiden, whatever his name is, in the first game. Yeah, it shows how much I loved him. Um, so Kaiden and Garrus. And I'm really hoping that they'll like go at it. Maybe if I can play them both, and then they'll have like a big fist bite in the end and then Garrus will kick his ass and then I'll I'll kick Caden to the curb and I'll be like, Garrus, you are my one true love. I kiss me, you fool. I'm... Yeah. If Carrie Underwood walks by, can she be sexy for us? Well, Carrie Underwood isn't in the building, but Sarah Underwood, maybe. I'm sure she could. Sarah's, Sarah just walking by is sexy. She is. And let me tell you something. I adore Sarah. She is just the sweetest, funnest gal. You love her. Can I get Ryan Seacrest? Uh, that's hard. He is insanely busy. I've only seen him in the building a few times. So, do I play Tekken games? I don't. Someone over here mentioned Bloody Roar, which I love. 
but nobody's making bloody war games anymore. Not since like PlayStation 2. So, or the original Xbox. I'm kind of out of luck, which sucks because I would love a bloody war game on the Xbox 360. That's all I can say. I'm sexy. I'm sexy and I know. Oh, wait, I can't sing that. Copyright. I'm extra sexy today because I made my hair all curly. Oh, I should have told you guys. Um, I told you guys last night that uh, Matt and I were going to this new show here in LA called Adventure. It is a uh, it is LARP meets theater, and I did a whole steampunk look. Let me tell you something. Bustle skirts on the theater? Not a good idea. Everybody stepped on it. I stepped on it. I tripped on it. So next time I'm going to pin it up. Or just wear pants. Yeah. But I am... Um, I... Do you want to re raise for the soup? I didn't know that. So we've had Matt Myra. Um, but I curled my hair last night, so it's still kind of wavy and it's all pretty accurate. Um, but I looked really good. Kicked some ass, took some names. Pulled a gun on everyone at the end. It was great. Nerf gun. A Nerf gun I showed you guys. Um, who are the characters in Resident Evil 6? Well, I know Leon... Uh, Leon's in it, and... Chris? Are those the two characters? Yeah, I'm not bipolar as far as I know of. Um, should go for an afro. You know, my hair will not keep a tease. I can try to tease my... Happy birthday, Sean Jordan! Come here, Sean Jordan! Meet the internet! You guys, have something really important to say before we go. Something incredibly, incredibly important. You stop me for a minute. Come here! Have an internet! You've all met Sean Jordan from the Tackle Show. Today is hey, his everyone. birthday. Aww. Wish him a happy birthday, Internet. Sean, who, who? Look, um, there he is. There he is. Now you're on my camera. See, he says happy birthday. Well, thank you. Yes, Sean, the awesome Aww. dude from the Tackle Show. How's your birthday going? Good, good. Awesome. I gotta get to the second fun? show and stuff. Oh, shit. Uh, no, Kevin and I are getting drinks uh, later well, tonight. Well, that'll be a lovely time. Yeah, no, it'll be fun. Awesome. Nice seeing you all. I'll come oh, back sometime bye. soon. Bye. He's going to go after the cabinet. Look at that. What's my pick for the Super Bowl? My pick is I won't even know what the result is. Let me tell you how much I care about Super Bowl. Shit. You know what I just realized? I'm not going to be able to play this on Sunday because my roommate is going to be hogging the TV to watch the Super Bowl. That's what I have to say about that. So, yeah. Um, she doesn't. Oh, oh, when I was in high school, I walked in one Monday morning and someone said to me, Hey, Courtney, who won the Super Bowl? And I said, Fuck if I know. And they said, See, we told you she wouldn't know. I never cared about football. I really don't. Really don't. My roommate, he loves football. And so, you know, I'll, I'll walk in the living room, he's watching a game, and I'll say, who are we rooting for? He'll say, you know, such team, and I say, go that team, and that's about the extent of my caring for football. What about hockey? Hockey, I'm slightly more interested in. I don't really care about teams, but I was a figure skater, so I like skating. No, you don't have to kill him, he's actually moving out next month, so I don't have to worry about that anymore. What about pandas? They are dying, but they're also being born. Actually, I read an interesting story today, that in China, they're having more, like, baby panda webcams in order to promote awareness for the need for breeding pandas and donating money towards it. So, yay. Will they ever take AOTS on the road? Um, I know they'd like to. It's just easier said than done. What was my hardest figure skating move that I landed? Double sow cow, maybe? Um, an axle? I was always a better spinner than a jumper because I am not aerodynamic. Just say it like that. So I was always very good at spinning. I could do flying camels and death drops and laybacks. I can still do a damn good layback to this day. Anyway, um, sorry, it's time for me to go. And lust over how I can't play this until tomorrow night. Um, but don't worry, I will be back here at 8 p.m. Eastern. Whoops, hang on, Van Hammer. Van Hammer. Ba -na 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 -na. Um, so I'll be back here at 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. For more G4 chats. Thank you, Adrian and Nando and all those people for coming by and chatting with us and you. And yes, our cam slots will be back up and running tomorrow. So have a wonderful night and I will see you then. Bye.